Yo guys, so today I bought a $675 Amazon return pallet. Now this right here is the pallet and it's full of a ton of Amazon boxes. Now we're actually out here at Detroit Pallet Liquidation. This is a liquidation company that has a ton of Amazon pallets, Sam's Club pallets, and a bunch of other stuff. Just check out this warehouse. This place is so dope. Now we've been here before and we opened one of these Amazon pallets last time. And you know what? I don't want to waste any time and I want to just hop straight into this thing. So let's get into this. All right guys, so yo, this one's actually huge. I feel like as soon as I cut this plastic, it's just going to fall down on me. In the last Amazon pallet, we got a ton of like baby stuff, which you, we don't have to mention, but we also got a ton of cool stuff. Like we got these insane car shocks that pretty much paid for the entire pallet. And so I'm going to end up putting a money counter on screen for this video because I want to keep track to see if we can profit from $675. But Joe, let's hop into this first box and see what we have. What the heck even is this? Ah! Okay, these are some like chandelier lights ain't no way these are actually like kind of dope looking what we got in here Look at that. That is legit a nice little chandelier light. I will definitely take that Yo, so I just looked this thing up on Amazon. This is going for like a solid 60 bucks I will definitely take that now guys also I did want to tell you that we're actually gonna be starting up a new trade-up challenge It's gonna be coming up pretty soon I'm gonna get a penny and I'm gonna be posting a video every day for the week. I hope you guys will enjoy Enjoy that but let's open up this box right here all right what do we have in this box okay i could have just looked at the package right here all right this looks like a white slide around cart right here hopefully i didn't break anything inside here got the directions and everything on how to assemble it why would someone return this this is actually kind of cool i feel like i would actually use something like this all right so on amazon right now these things go for a solid 25 dollars. we're gonna add that to the money counter up there i feel like we're gonna get some pretty good stuff out of this i mean this palette is just huge we got this uh chewy box right here what brand is chewy is that like dog food or something oh Yo, wait a second. This is actually kind of cool. Ain't no way. All right, we got a little gold rack right here. And then that's kind of dope. Ain't no way. Isn't Chewy like a dog brand or something? What kind of dog is going to be drinking out of that? Cool little plant pot right here. You know what would look sick in there as a bonsai. All right, so on Amazon right now, they have a pack of two of these guys. It goes for 60 bucks, but we only have one in here. So I guess the person probably like yanked the other one and just returned one. But I mean, hey, let's say 60 bucks. We'll cut that in half. We'll go 25, all right? That's not exactly half, but next up right here. Yo, does this say Walmart? That's a Walmart box. Yo, all right, let's hop into this thing. What we got from Walmart? Speak to me. Do we got a pack of Pokemon cards in here? That's the only thing I'd be buying at Walmart. Is this a cushion? Yeah. Nice little cushions for your uh, like patio furniture outside. Actually, here's one right here. All right. Nice little gray cushion. Can't go wrong with it. There's the brand on it. What is it? Down Lux? Down Lux. Let's see if it's comfy. I'm down for Lux. I'll take it. I'm seeing they got a pack of four right now for 45 on Amazon. Okay. Next up, we're going to go off the top right here crack this thing open. I absolutely love doing these pallets because you genuinely don't know what's going to be inside. I mean, there could be some pretty cool stuff inside here, but what is this? Wait, what? What is this? Ah, okay, wait a second. This is actually kind of nice. If I can open it, maybe that's why they returned it is because this sucker is just... <sighs> I'm not even gonna try. This is actually pretty cool. It's a uh, like a pitcher or something. You fill this part up with ice so it stays cold so it doesn't get watered down. And then on the inside is where you pour it and there's gonna be your little nozzle, which is down here. Come over here, put your cup here, but a boom, bada boom, pretty sick. My guess is gonna be a hot $25 on this boy. Let's scan it and see how much this is. Ain't no way, ain't no way. This thing is 60 bucks. I was wrong. I mean, shoot, let's just say it's worth 30. I'm probably down for that. And yo, by the way, we are gonna end up giving something away out of this pallet. I don't know what exactly that is yet. If we end up finding something cool, something that you guys might like, we'll give it away. But yo, let's see what we got in this box right here. Yo, what is that? Oh wait, this is actually kind of cool. Okay, we got some bottles right here that you can, uh... it's an airtight seal right there, baby. We could probably use these bottles to you know, get our drink from that pitcher thing. It comes with six of these right here, plus a thing where you can stick it in there, pour it in so it's easier. That's legit. So I just looked these up. The six pack is worth like 30 bucks right here. I mean, pretty sick. I'm gonna give it the value of like, let's say 20, all right? Yo, I'm actually liking the variety that we've been pulling off this thing so far. What the heck is this? All right, it looks like we got some kind of shelves right here. These like mantles, wooden mantles. Why are they like 
like wrapped up perfectly. It doesn't even look like anyone's opened these things up or nothing. That's actually pretty cool. Let's see this. Thank you for giving our small family business a shot, our orders or something. Oh my gosh, and they returned it. Well, I guess uh, no thank you for giving our small business a shot. Sorry, but your stuff got returned. It definitely looks like it's a hanging shelf or something, like a wooden mantle. Sometimes these things can be pretty expensive. So check this out right here on Amazon, that two pack right there. 24 inches, 70 bucks. I could actually use these for my house, so I don't know if I really wanna sell them. Next up right here, I don't even wanna touch this. Oh no, I am not opening this up. I mean, it could just be in a different package. There could be something else inside here. I'm just too scared to open it. Um, foldable toilet frame, no. <laughs> Value is $10. It's probably way more than that, but that's how I'm gonna value it because I just don't wanna open it. Not gonna lie, I just looked on Amazon, that thing goes for 100 bucks. That's probably the most expensive item we found and I, I'm still not opening it. Nope, I'll say 60 bucks max on that thing. But Joe, let's hop into this one right here. This one looks like it was not packaged up very good and I feel like I'm not gonna be able to get this back in here, whatever this is. Huh, is this just stuffing for more oomph? Add me. I'm good. I don't need no more oomph in my life. Yeah, definitely got a pillow right here. We got the coop pillow. Let me pull this thing out. Oh yeah. What the heck is that? It looks like a cow or something or like a dog. And ew, what is, what is it? All right, I'm putting it back. It's actually kind of comfortable, I'm not gonna lie. It feels kind of squishy. It definitely feels like there's some oomph inside it. Ain't no way these coop pillows go for that much. 70 to 100 dollars, why? I mean, if you're sleeping good, you're sleeping good. I don't know exactly how it feels to sleep on this thing, but I could probably get a solid 40 bucks. Listen, we definitely took some off the top right here. I feel like a barber. Taking a little bit off the top, but inside here, what we got? What do we have right here? Is there an image or anything on this to give me a little hint or no? Dude, this box looks like it's filled with bubble wrap. Oh wait, there is something. What the heck is this? Ah! All that bubble wrap for that? Okay, sure, why not? That's pretty cool. We got a nice little lap desk right here. You can put your drink in there. What lap desk has a cup holder, dude? That is actually sick. It props up and everything too. What's up, son? Have a nice little work day with this. Oh, the cup holder just popped out. Yo, that's actually pretty sick. Like, I feel like I would actually use this. Prop your book or your phone up there or something and do a little computer work on your nice little lap desk. I like it. Seeing one on Amazon right now, Go for close to 40 bucks. I'll take that. This could be something cool that we could give away, but you know what? I'm, I'm just gonna hold, I'm gonna hold off, all right? We're not gonna give this one away because I feel like we can find something cool in here to give away. All right, next up right here, we got this thing. Oh, this thing kind of feels a little heavy. I like when the box feels heavy. Oh my gosh, because I get excited that there's something just really cool, but sometimes heavy does not mean cool. Is this a lazy Susan? I Yeah, probably. I'm good. Wooden. Lazy Susan right here. This is something that I'm not huge on. You put the tray on top of the tray and then it spins and hooray. Yeah, I'm not too huge on this look. I mean, even though my fiance Hannah, she'd probably be obsessed with this thing and she's probably gonna want it, but no. <laughs> no. We're gonna say that thing is worth $10 and put it away. Next up right here, this feels like a lighter box, but it sounds like we got some stuff rattling around in here. What the heck? Why, why are we putting a huge box for this much stuff? There is like, wait, wait, whoa, what the heck is that? Wait a second, wait a second. Oh dude, this is a huge find. Yo, this is actually a huge find. This is sick. Why didn't they wrap this up nicely though? Because look, there's like a scratch going across the screen right here. Yo, so this right here is some kind of car screen. You install this into your car, you got a nice little screen now. I have no idea what car this would go to. We have some instructions right here. I'm saying Honda Civic. So on Amazon right now, this thing is going for 150 bucks. And I was close. What did I say? I said Honda Civic, Toyota Corolla. I was so close. I was, I was right in the same genre, right? Close enough. This is actually pretty cool. I can see this in like a cool souped up Toyota Corolla. I mean, it's got all the cords and everything to it. Listen, on a bad day, I'd say a solid 80 bucks for that. Next up, we're going with the smaller box. Oh no, we got a more... We got more pillows. Wait a second, what is this though? This is a cool pillow. Comfy life. Comfy life. Wow. 
five dollars next up we're going with this box so this has been a pretty sick palette so far i don't know the exact value of what we're up i don't think we made up our money so far oh my gosh what in the rainbow holy smokes that is a lot in a lot of tupperware this is just a huge set of the Easter rainbow colorway of Tupperware. This is not going anywhere near my house. I mean, this is borderline baby stuff right here. And $15. Yo, wait, what is this right here though? This has a car on the package. And last time I checked, whenever there's a car on the package, I mean, there's something good. Shut up. Oh, wait a second. Is that like, these right here, these are like window shields. Okay, it's decent, decent. I like the window shield. Do we have anything else in here? More. Okay, we got the front and the back. What is this too? This is to a Dodge Durango. That's actually pretty decent. I'm gonna say a solid $30 on there. All right, here we go. We got another box right here. Oh my gosh, this one, this one has a little bit of weight to it. I'm glad when they uh, bubble wrap their packages now. Oh snap, what do we got? What the? What the heck? Is that to like a bike or something? Do you sit on this? I hope not. What is this too? What is this thing? So this right here, you actually don't sit on it. This is where your back is supposed to go. This is called a sissy bar. What? So this is actually for like motorcycles and stuff or Vespas or whatever it is. It's a backrest. So you put that on your bike, bada bing, bada boom. Your back is comfy. But yo, look at this. This is actually going for $135 right now. That's pretty sick. It looks in pretty good shape. I'm sure we could get at least a hundred bucks for this thing. Listen, we're cutting down more of the box right now. I'm excited, all right? We're getting to it, baby. This has been like a really, really good palette so far. This box feels extremely light, but it has that adorable smiling Amazon face on it, which should make me happy because, wow, this looks like that box that they had in SpongeBob. Huh? Just looks like nothing was in here. What even is this thing though? Oh wait, is this for like a 3D printer? Why do I feel like this is something for a 3D printer? Say hello to my little friend. This right here is a motor for a recliner for like, like old people. So for like power reclining chairs, this is the motor for it. I thought it was gonna be something really cool, like an attachment for a 3D printer. But I mean, hey, the thing goes for like a hundred bucks. I'm happy about that. I'll definitely take it. All right, next up, we're going for the long box. Usually when there's like a long box, it's like furniture or something, but this does not feel like furniture. What is this? Ah, okay, that's pretty cool. You know what? You'd actually probably need something like this. I already have one. You have one? How much you pay for it? 50 bucks, I think. 50 bucks, I'll take it. This right here is a retractable gate for like, you know, your babies, your dogs, your frogs, your sister, your nephew, your uncle. Why are you locking them out of the bedroom? I couldn't tell you, but that's what this is for right here. Why am I trying to sell this thing? I have no idea, but that's, it's pretty cool. Dad uses one of these things for his dog. You like put it somewhere, you pull it, it's a little gate. That's dope. Next up, let's see what this is right here. Oh man, stuff is rattling around like crazy in this box. All right, let's see. Wait, what does this even say? Snake plant? Oh, artificial snake plant. There's probably a, there's a snake in here. Oh, yo, wait a second. Wait a second, this is the set. Watch there be a snake in here or something. This would be terrifying. Look it, stand, like the last stand we had. Not no M&M stand. That's kind of sick. Warning to avoid danger of suffocation. We're good, I'm not gonna suffocate on the plant. It's a nice little plant. Solid $70 right here. Boom, look at that. That's pretty cool. And it looks brand new too. I actually really like that. I'm trying to find like a really cool item that you guys would like enjoy. I mean, who knows? Maybe you guys would have really liked that snake plant thing, but I don't know. We got to find something cool in here. This box is very heavy. I'm gonna get to that next. We'll go with this one right here. Here we go, baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, what is this? This looks very deluxe. Slumber pod. Did we get one of these in the last palette or something like this? Oh my god, wait a second, it's baby stuff. Never mind. Gosh, this right here is a baby tent. This is the first baby thing we got hit with in this palette, and you know what? I'll take it though, all right? It's a pretty cool tent. Comes with this little fan. You prop up the little tent, and the baby goes to sleep in it. Holy smokes, ain't no way. Tell me why this is like one of the most expensive items that we found so far. This thing goes for 200 bucks. The baby slumber tent. This is the first baby thing we found, and it's like the most expensive item. Nice. 200 bucks. Better than the last time you it, baby stuff. Exactly. <laughs> and by the way, this is Bashar. He's the person who owns this place and uh, who has a great selection of pallets. Thank you. Uh-huh. You. you kill it with pallets. Thank you. 
Yeah, this thing is definitely, definitely, definitely brand new. I'm staying solid 200 bucks all day on this guy. Look it, I didn't want baby stuff and now we got baby stuff and I'm happy about it. All right, this one feels pretty heavy. That one I know is pretty heavy. Oh my gosh. All right, I get excited when things are heavy for some reason. I feel like this is about to be something sick. Holy smokes. I don't know if I'm gonna pull this out. What is this though? It's storage, magical panel storage. All right, so I actually couldn't find this on Amazon. I don't know what the heck I'm even gonna put in, but what this is, it's like a, a bunch of like storage racks. Like it's a bunch of like trays and stuff and it's just for storage. I'm gonna say solid 80 bucks on these, all right? Only because it's very heavy and I feel like heavy stuff just usually goes for a lot of money for some reason. All right, let's see what this is though, because this is also heavy and I'm excited for this. I've only read the first word on the box and it said something luxury. So what kind of luxury something we got right here? Okay, baby. Ooh, that's actually dope. That is actually really dope. Luxury fan lamp. Come on now, talk nice to me. It looks like the person had no idea how to put this thing together, so they just returned it. Sounds like something my dad would do. Comes with the remote control and everything. Thing, this thing's gotta be expensive. I'm not even gonna open it up because it does look like there's a lot of parts, a lot of pieces, and a lot of work. <sighs> okay, we just found like one of the best items inside this box right here. All right, so here's the fan. That's what it looks like. There's the balls that I was just feeling. All right, pause. These right here are the balls for the fan. But yo, check this out. $450 brand new. $450. On a bad day, we get 300 bucks for this. On a bad day. Yo, that is so sick. That is literally almost half the palette. That is insane. Luxury fan lamp. If I would have read it, I just would have known what it is right away. So it's better finding it out, opening the box. But yeah, that is sick. Next up right here, we got this box. And this is sold as a set. So hopefully the set's inside here. Yo, this is actually dope. These right here, I, I love how I'm like freaking out over something just so weird, but these right here are lights for recessed lighting. I actually have these in my house. This is like the ultimate new wave of lighting. You screw those things into the light bulb socket, boom, recessed lighting. Yeah, this is pretty sick right here. So it looks like we got like a pack of 12 in here. And check this out. Pack of 12 for only 60 bucks? That's kind of a steal. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of a steal. I say any day, we can get probably 40 bucks for these guys. That's pretty cool though. Next up, we're gonna go with, what the heck is this light little box? Ain't no way there's gonna be something good in this light little box. It's gonna be another pillow, isn't it? Oh, what the heck is that? Oh, I want these. You want these? Is it a hat? <laughs> what the heck is this? Round ball. What do you mean round ball? It's like a round plant like this. Fake round ball plant like this? Yeah. Like a pokeball? Yeah. All right. Yeah. You want them? Yeah. yeah. Here you go. You can take them. Thank you. No. Thank you for your purchase. All right. Uh, yeah. Oh, I see it now. Okay. So you kind of like put it in these yeah. things yeah, and uh, the, yeah. eh, 40 bucks. Solid 40 bucks, I'll take it. All right, what we got in this UPS box right here? Somebody definitely repackaged this boy right here in a different box. What is, what the heck is that? That looks like a bunch of rubber. 20 bucks. Next up, let's check this out. What the heck, this thing is so light. Cake baking sheet. Is that what this is gonna be, a cake baking sheet? What the heck? <laughs> Yo, somebody call like Michael Jackson or Prince up because holy smokes. Okay, I see it now. You put that there, you build your cake on here, and then boom, all right, $5 max. All right, next up right here, Balucci. What we got in here? Oh wait, yo, this is kind of cool. That's a nice Balucci key rack right there. That's a really nice key rack, or coat rack, or whatever you want to call it, that's sleek, that's nice. Balucci. 35 bucks, brand new. All right, here we go, next up, I'm going for this green box. DIY badge making machine. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I like it. It's a badge making machine. Value on this thing, solid $50. I feel like everything in this box so far has been like 50, 40, 60, like nonstop. This has been like an extremely good palette. What is this? All right, let's hop in here. Wait a second. Dude, this is good. If I can get it out. Ain't no way. This is actually insane. Okay, so what I'm pretty sure this is, it's like a POS system. They have a receipt printer. 
on the inside of this right here. This is pretty nice. This is, this thing swivels and everything. That's actually really, really nice. It tells you how to set it up and everything. It's an app. Check this thing out right now. This thing's going for like $300 brand new. That is insane. That was actually pretty cool. I like seeing that. Next up, we're going to go with this box. What in the absolute what? Is that a sleeping bag or something? That's an air mattress. That is definitely an air mattress inside this thing. No wonder the box is so beat. I'm just going to show it to you guys right there. Just like that. Air mattress. 60 bucks. All right. Next up right here. Oh my God. I just saw the picture on this one. Dude. Ain't no way. This is sick. Let me open this thing up. I'm not going to open it all the way. I just want to see kind of what's popping in here. That thing's like brand new. I'm not going to open this thing up because I'm going to have to like put it all together. Check this thing out right here. That's a nice office chair. Plus this thing goes for 170 bucks. 170 bucks. Okay. Dude, that is dope. This thing is like totally brand new too. All right. So next we're going with this one right here. What do we have in here though? This looks like some... Huh? Oh, wow. Oh, wow, what? That's great. Those are table legs if you're making a table. Oh, it's table legs. That's cool. Okay. Why does it only come with three? It's a tripod? Tripod it's table legs? Three. I'm joking. There's four in here. I'm going to say a rough value, 40 bucks. All right, so yo, next up right here. Yo, this looks dope. One second. Let's open this thing up. Ain't no way. Kind of looks a little used, or is that just... That's kind of cool. I don't know. That is that is kind of cool. This is pretty cool. So what this is, it's a LED light that you can probably like Bluetooth to your phone and play some music out of this thing as well. This is pretty cool. I just opened this up. There got a bunch of LED lights and everything inside here. We got the speaker in the middle. I'm sure like with this thing on, probably looks pretty sick. Solid $35 right there. Yo, we're breaking this thing down. I'm starting to be able to see over this thing now. This is ridiculous. What is this? Oh gosh. Uh-uh. <laughs> no, ain't no way. All right, this will be another box that I do not open. This is a Zimmer portable toilet and I am good. That will be portable right in the box. You know what, let's just take a little peek. All right, I am definitely not touching this thing. That's as far as we're going into that box, all right? Thing's probably great for camping. Even though this thing goes for about like 80 bucks, I'm good. I'm good. Portable toilet, 30 bucks max. Let's crack this one open right here though. Ooh, this is a comfy Amazon box. It is a, a gray comforter, you know? 30 bucks. This has been like an extremely good box so far. I definitely think we're up there in value from everything we have. We ended up getting some pretty cool stuff this time. I feel like it wasn't just like useless stuff. Like we actually got like some things that like, I feel like I could use and, oh man. Whoa, whoa. Is this for the family function barbecues? I think we got the whole campsite ready to go. Wait a second. Is it a hot dog maker? I don't know, you put your hot dog Wait, there. is this for like cooking or is this like a jewelry cleaning machine? What is this? Oh, I should have known. It's a water bath. <laughs> Come on. Is this for jewelry? Is this for food? Is this for digital display? Oh, obviously. It's a digital display thermostat water bath. This right here is not for jewelry. This right here is not for the cookout. This right here is for science. This right here, this piece of machinery, this could have been used by Bill Nye or this could have been in Breaking Bad. You pick. You know how much this one goes for? Take a guess. You got no idea. $60. You gonna lowball him like that? Speak to him, Bill Nye. What you know about that 150? I swear, I am like so American. I really thought this was a hot dog thing or like a thing for the family cookout. All right, so yo, next up right here, we're going with this one. We're getting down to it, guys. We got probably about like maybe 10 or 15 more boxes left to go. So we're gonna start flying through this. What we got in here? Oh, some more water bath. I'm joking, it's not a water bath, but oh my. This is actually pretty cool. Ain't no way, this is actually really, really cool. So this looks like a, uh, a cool like farm lamp type thing. This is actually dope. I feel like it could look good in the crib. Check it out right here. It's a cool like farm lighting lamp thing. Solid 40 bucks on that. I'll take it. Next up, I'm going in between these things. All right, what is this? We found like a bunch of bricks of gold right here. What is this? And psych. Nope. What is this? It's shiny. Do I know what it is? No, but it is shiny. What in the world is, is this like a display thing? 
you put it all together and it's like a layered display thing what the heck got the directions right here let's check it out that's what it is i'm saying a hot 30 bucks on this one max we breaking this down baby i'm going for this big box what is this i'm dying to know oh my gosh <laughs> what the heck <laughs> It's a soccer ball, but not just one soccer ball. We got probably about like 30 different, 30 different soccer balls. What? Did an elementary school go out of business or something and they had to return this? What, what, it, why? That is a lot of soccer balls. Wow. I, I'm lost for words on this one. Here it is on Amazon right here. A 24 pack of soccer balls for 110 bucks. I guess I'm gonna start a new hobby. All right, next. Man, we got a few boxes left, but this has just been so much fun. Let me know if you guys want me to do this again. I think it's fun just opening these packages, seeing what we get. Care Touch Blood Glucose Test Strips. What is that for? Comforter. We got another comforter inside the trash bag. Okay, that's the second comforter we got. And I don't know what's up with these strips right here, but I'm just gonna throw that back in there. Solid 20 right there. Next up, what we got right here. What is this? Is this like a file? What the, what? There is so many pieces to this puzzle. I'm gonna say minus $10 for this one. All right, here we go. What is this? I think we already know what this is by looking at the package right here. I already see you eyeballing these things. Dad, uh, for some reason, is obsessed with hangers. These right here are uh, white velvet hangers. Oh, nice. Yeah. You are so old. <laughs> <laughs> they are actually pretty cool. It's uh, They got the gold end. <laughs> there you go, these are yours, Pops. <laughs> these are yours. Oh man, there you go, you're welcome. Next box right here. Ah, okay. This right here is like one of those chairs when your doctor like pulls up next to you and is like, all right, listen, here's the plan for this year. And then you just blank out after that, you know? You just kinda, yeah. Why do I feel like these chairs are, could actually go for some cash though? Yeah, wait, you know what? I knew my doctor was cheap, I think. 30 bucks telling me that I'm supposed to eat better and stuff. Get out of here. All right, next up, this box got my attention. All right, yo, wait, what? Is this like, what? This is kind of cool. This is very, very unique if this is what I think it is. What in the absolute world is this keyboard? That is so crazy looking. Okay, it's a keyboard, which looks like a school keyboard. All right, like it looks like almost every single, like your generic, is a keyboard you go to school with, but this thing is like split, completely split down the center. It definitely looks very old, I will tell you that, but maybe it's like a cool like vintage, I don't know, I think we need a couple of years before this thing is cool again. I just looked it up on Amazon though and it's surprisingly like 50 bucks, but I'm gonna value this at a solid 20. All right, we're going big boy. What we got for big boy box right here? You know what we're gonna have in here? We're about to have something sick. I'm gonna call it right now, this is a arcade machine. Nowhere close. Nowhere close. What, is that a tent? It does have 100% warranty. So far, we're in the clear. Oh, dude. Dude. This is decent. This is decent, what we have right here. RV cover. Whoa. This boy's about to be expensive. All right, so I got really excited over nothing. I mean, it's still a good product, but 150 bucks. We'll take that. All right, next up. We got this box, no bubble wrap again, but we got the Max Mini Massager right here. These things are amazing. You know what? I think we're about to run the giveaway on this thing right here. You can't go wrong with a massage gun, all right? Everyone in their mom wants a massage gun, right? I mean, even me, I need a massage gun, but we're gonna give this guy away. So listen, to get this massage gun, all you guys have to do, go on Instagram, go follow Detroit Palette Liquidation, follow your boy at Connor TV on Instagram, and go down in the comments on this video and comment, do more pallets. I like that, yeah. Do more pallets, comment that down below so it motivates me to do more. But yeah, guys, this could be yours right here. If you do those steps, good luck on the giveaway. All right, guys, but yo, next up, this box feels very industrial. I think we're gonna get something industrial in here. Would you look at that? It's a green industrial tarp. I'm gonna say a solid $20 on the tarp right here. Next up on the pallet though, that is so sick. I don't even gotta open it. Wait a second, this puppy is sealed. This puppy is brand new. Ain't no way. Boom, full motion mount. 
for your TV. 32 to 65 inches. Now that's a lot of inches. That's what she said. <laughs> TV mounts, everyone has a TV. $50 all day long on this boy. We got two more items right here. Oh my gosh, you know what that is? A storage box. This right here is a uh, storage box. This actually looks like kind of a deluxe storage box right here. Is this puppy brand new too? I think this thing's brand new too. The plastic, the storage, the uh, everything. Yeah, that's dope. Let's look this thing up really quick. This is cool. Why do I feel like every item is like a hundred something bucks right here? Look at that. A hundred and sixty buckaroonos for this storage guy right here. I will take that all day long. That's actually really dope. I feel like I'm gonna end up using that at the house. For the last item on this pallet, Holy smokes, this thing is heavy. For the last item, it better be something good. It's a walker or a, a roller. Okay, you know when you, you break your leg and you, you're in a cast and you're like on that thing and you're like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is what it is right here. There you go. It's a walker thing. That's gotta be one of the flyest scooters I've ever seen. What I will say though, is look at how fly this thing is. Dude, you got a whole lunch pack on the front of this thing. Look at them shocks. Those things, dude, this thing probably is amazing on gas. Look at that, 90 bucks. <laughs> all day, I'll take it. I'll add an extra 10 on top of that. That's a hundred dollar item right there. Guys, listen, that has been insane. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This palette has been absolutely crazy. Go down in the comments, let me know what your favorite thing was inside it. And let me know down in the comments if you wanna see me do another one of these things. Again, huge shout out to Detroit Palette Liquidation. But y'all, that's gonna wrap this video up. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, do not forget to smash that subscribe button. But y'all, I love you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.